we go into episode number 17 of Xenoverse, and I need a quick team recap, just as much as you guys do. All right, so we got Tempest the Gyarados here, currently holding that lucky egg, so I'm trying to get him experience right now. We got Fisher the Sandy Gast. It feels like I jumped in right this episode, I wasn't really quite ready, but you know. Got Arthur the Medieval, you know, with all those runes and everything going on. Got Aragog the Garvantula. Got Tomato the Pep. Pepintuno, Pepincuno, something like that, yeah. And we got our Lolan Grimer now, level 12. Apparently in this game, trade evolutions are set levels, so... <clears throat> I actually took a downgrade in levels whenever I got him. I went ahead and set up where we're supposed to go in the forest, I went ahead and moved the boulder, and I found out that... <clears throat> that new crystal that we got, um, the... Herculeum, Hercule, Hercule, I can't say that, but th 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 that name is a Pokemon's name, and I, it's a Pokemon I haven't even seen yet, so like, I think that's a really cool thing, but yeah, we're just kind of like, moving through here now, I was pretty much fighting any extra, uh, Pokemon that I encountered along the way, I don't think I really fought any trainers, unfortunately, um, and I am going to go ahead and activate a repel. I'm a little bit, um, I'm going to call it winded, but also a little bit like, uh, got a high, high heartbeat right now because I uh, just took uh, Sophie out and uh, she started a ruckus with another dog, so that was the whole thing. Oh, I get to see this thing and I get to know what it is. It's a Hercules beetle. Um, so it's probably a fighting type, so I can probably just waterfall it, right? Okay, um, that's fine, roughly speaking. If I can flinch it, though, that'd be even better. I'm curious, maybe it's the punch, punching bag thing that, that evolves into? Maybe. I'm not 100%, but like, I'm gonna call it a maybe. Um, no, I don't really need Rain Dance. Arthur's level 30. I feel like the Lucky Egg might increase everyone's level. Acid Bomb. User spits fluid that works to melt the target, reduces special defense harshly. I could see where that would be helpful. I'm gonna keep my moves because. Uh, Muck and Grimer are more physical attackers anyways. Man, that did a lot for me, actually. I guess I think it's more of a physical attacker. Yeah. Yeah. Plus, I have the right nature for it, too, actually. Um... Do I want to heal? I don't think I don't to heal yeah I think Tempest has like a big possibility of just being like stupid useful on the team right now oh wow there's not much to this cave okay so this is a new encounter right here um I want to put Fisher out front because Fisher has hypnosis and we're gonna go ahead and check out what we get here on route 12 oh yeah I also um decided put it on a new camera angle so I kind of went for a lower camera angle so you guys um I look a little bit more at the camera but not a lot more at the camera because like it's still like a lot higher than can I make an encounter here I really want to say I can't oh <laughs> Uh, cool. Whoops. Okay, punch bug. The way that punch bug lurks, looks, and the way that the Hercules thing looks, I really think they're, like, in the same vein. Uh, bug and fighting. 
I don't have anyone to like hit it. Um, but it can't really hit Sandy Gas here too well. Okay, I guess I can just kind of like flinch it out. I think the best move it has to hit me with is maybe like Bug Bite by this level. I never got this high, so I don't really know. I might just have Arm Thrust though. So it's just gonna keep trying to use Focus Energy, I guess. Honestly, ghost types are such a W, like, all the time in Nuzlocke's. Especially if you get a defensive one, like a Dusclops, or in my case, a Sandy Gas here. It's just, it's so good. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Poison Fang? Heck yeah. You know, I bet I could just teach that grammar Toxic. Like, why have Poison Gas when you can have Toxic? Um... There it is. I was like, man, I, I really want to get rid of um, poison gas for something better. I'm like, oh wait, I have the better version of that. It's more accurate and it does better damage. I think it's like worse than poison for a single turn and then it's better than poison. All right, so now I can get my encounter here. A Numel. I'm not. I'm not mad about a Numel. I think it's more just like interesting. I didn't expect to see a Numel here. Um. I can. I think about changing out um, Tomato because Tomato is like not pulling his weight, and I I know about what Numel can do. But I also don't exactly want another Ground type on the team. But his ground typing wouldn't hurt me though, I guess, It's what I would say. And I have uh, Fisher here, like, is just immune to water types. So, at least until my stats are maxed out. I don't know, I'm just kind of like thinking out loud, you know, like... I think, I think I'm gonna keep using, like, new mons right now. Until I just don't have them to use anymore. Um, I'm trying to think of a name. Cow. Um, is it a male or female? I wasn't paying attention to that. The magma in its body reaches 2,200 degrees Fahrenheit. Its humps, hump gets smaller when it uses fire type moves. That's interesting. Male. Okay. Um, bull. Um,. I think the name of like a, a famous bull. But I got nothing. Um hey, stop. Um you know, I'm gonna call you Aladdin. I might have spelled it wrong. Ooh. It got almost knocked over my light. At least one of them. Always oh, got two lights pointing at me whenever I'm doing recording, and it is bright and it hurts my eyes after a while. Going to resituate here in a second. Gonna walk on past you. Sucks I want to fight people, but like I'm also a little bit worried too without knowing exactly where healing is. Alright, that's fine. Only the strongest one can survive the bad weather. Wait, what bad weather? Oh, right, right, right. We got sent, like, this way because there's, like, um, sandy bad weather. Um, I don't, there's a lot going on with this thing. Are those feathers or, like, what, what is that? I don't like, it's not very effective, but also it doesn't look like it matters. Maybe it's a dragon. I can see it being like a baby dragon. Does me. Grimer's really gaining the. Oh, right. Grimer gets boosted experience. That's right. That is not so good. Maybe I can still get a flinch, though. Uh, no. I can't. Hey, uh, let me see if Crunch does more. Nope. 
Does that just um, negate my stat changes, or is it his stat changes too? No, oh, good thing I have Splash in my back pocket though. Ooh, wow. I'm the other one that speeds you up. No. Flame Charge is the one that speeds you up. I'm getting all sorted. Wait, who's 34? Oh, Aragog. Yeah, that makes sense. Aragog was like a fully evolved Mon, so I had no problem giving him a little bit extra. I feel like there are probably better Mons here than Numel. I can't say that Numel is very high on my tier list for, you know... Like, I literally could have had a Manticore. I bet that thing evolves into something really sick looking, too. It sucks. You, you play a game and you want to, like, use the new Mons in it, but then they just... You don't get the new Mons as encounters. Um, I feel like I'm not... Okay, maybe this is a rest house. Um, to Port Belt Town. Please be a rest house. No no sing here in Eldwee. Geodude are different from those I'm used to. Um, gotcha. No, I don't really care about Alolan Geodude that much. Path Volcano is too harsh for you, kid. Oh. Okay, so as far as I can tell, there is no one who heals you around here. There are a stinking lot of trainers. Um, is there really no one who heals you throughout here? That's just insane. I just, I can't imagine that like, there's like, Eight to ten trainers here, and there's nothing that you can do to get healing except go back through the entire cave you just were in. Um, only thing you can hear around here is Drudigan roaring. There must be a den around here somewhere. Ooh, hello, Dragon Claw. So, is it this? New. No. Uh, I can't get around, so that's cool. Ah, oh, boy. I do not like this right now. I do not like this Sam I am. Definitely don't like that. Um, what in the world am I going to do a vile plume? Um, I guess I've got my spider in my back pocket. Wait. No, mine never learned moon blast. Mine was way higher level than this one. Could I have done a move relearner and I had gotten Moon Blast? That would have been awesome. Okay, I know I'm going to outspeed, so I'm fine, right? Yes, cool. With that, though, I do think it's time I switch Tempest out of the front until I know where my next healing spot is. I could see Minimize being something. Get disable, learn minimize. Alright, let's do a move over there. I'm going to take the lucky egg from him and give it to Grimer for right now. Get him up to par a little bit faster. I'm very glad though they gave you the lucky egg. I'm gonna save uh me up. An amount of time while I'm doing this stuff. Okay, uh, apparently there's maybe not as many trainers as I thought there were. Oh yeah, the Manticore. Manticore cure. Something like that, I can see it. Go Frost Breath. Ooh, baby. Okay, it wasn't even super effective, okay. And it's Rotini, that is a no problem right there. Let me just cross breath real quick, hold on. Oh, yeah. 
Right. Okay. So like, obviously, I'm still wearing the same shirt. So I think this is the fifth video I've recorded today in this series, and I ha already have like all of them. Wait. No. 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 I think this is the sixth video I've recorded today. I don't know. I've just been really like feeling it. Like Xenoverse just feels good to play right now. I feel like this cherry gives me. Uh, one more time. I feel like this tree gives me berries. Please let me run from this thing. I'm very speedy. Okay, no, maybe not. Um, there aren't that many more trainers here. I just see if I can go ahead and fight them. Oh look, another thing I'm quad weak to. Rock and fire, man. Those aren't common typings anywhere. All right. There's this guy over here that I'm just gonna go ahead and fight. Like, why not? Then I can run in there and get my next encounter. Maybe I'll get something special like Manticore. Ooh, studying Pokemon that have the volcano area. My nose hurts. I think, um, whenever my allergies were acting up, I was blowing my nose a lot. <sighs> Which means I'm like rubbing it a lot to you know uh you get the excess like you know snot off and i um rubbed it too much hey look at that we completed the gym leader now we're on to the champion cool maybe it's only 50 like we're only on badge three right now i can't imagine you not hitting it something has to be like a fairy poison which is such a fun typing I know that I think steel is better with fairy, and I think there is a steel fairy type. I can't. Re oh yeah, Zacian. That's right. It its typing is like super duper broken. Yo, hollow trap inch. Ooh, focus ash. Uh, that kind of reminded me of another thing that I wanted to check. Um, go to the Pokedex. I was right, that is Yamin's evolution. Yeah. Looks like mascot is a single evolution mon. Does well it doesn't have an evolution. Same with this cat thing, it doesn't have an evolution? No way. That's kind of boring. They've made some cool mods, but then like didn't give them evolutions to like expand on them. I was right, that is Kid Loons or Kidoon's evolution. Oh, yes, and I was right. Uh, Punchbug turns into that Herculean Beetle. That actually would be a super sick mon, I feel like. Maybe I should take another look at that guy. I don't know, though. Best bet he replaces Tomato, but I don't know. I don't really need another bug type. Like, I think I have nice type diversity right now. So I kind of want to keep it that way. Oh, wait. I get an encounter in here. Is this even a new area? No, it doesn't give me an area change actually. So this is just like a little path in between for reasons, I guess. Okay. We're definitely still on route 12. And now we're in Fort Belt Town. It is a very dark town. It is hard to see. Oh, I'm guessing it's like ashy. Gotcha. Alright, I just want to talk to this guy real quick. Um, who's the one I've gotten pretty recently? Maybe Tempest can learn something new now that he's evolved into a Gyarados. He sure can! Hello, Ice Fang. Let me get Ice Fang, honestly. I think that's really it. You're just Splash, man. Be just destroying these dragon types out here. 
Um, no, you don't really have. Maybe Arthur has something now that he's evolved. Yeah, magic room. Like magic room's not a bad thing. Rock slide's also not bad. I think what I really want is like head smash. Hmm. Is there anything else? Anyone else? Uh, I guess there's the Grimer, but I doubt Grimer really has done anything. Yeah, no. <laughs> Those are all moves I made him forget. It seems that beside the idol of fire and other civilizations, they worship the idol of grass and an idol of water. Interesting. Idol of fire statue either. Okay. Uh, that's cool. Uh, my dongo might have just turned off one of my monitors, but not my screw, not my like computer. But it does make me worry. Um, okay, that's really annoying. Uh. So now I don't exactly know how long time's going. I'm roughly at 20 minutes now. I know that much. So I'll do my best uh, from here forward to kind of guesstimate my time. Ooh, full heals. Bows. Uh, are these max ethers? Elixirs. I can see where elixirs would come in handy. Give me, give me two. I haven't really needed any of them yet, but I, I think I might. I threw a firestone at it, and I didn't know the Conconite's head that could become. Oh! It evolves by firestone! That makes so much more sense than this random item I was looking at. Oh, that's so much easier. I can evolve my little grass boy probably soon. I know this might sound weird to you, but I am discerning. I'm a discerning collector of cans. Are cans with you? I'd love to have a look. Do I? Oh. Cool. I got an idle fire. I don't know what that does. Um, it's a famous four pulp idle fire, but I honestly don't know what's so special about it. Okay, so I'm sure those will come in handy later. For probably some like side quest, but for right now they're just nothing for me. Ooh, flame orb? Okay, okay, I see. When you encounter a wild Pokemon, don't flee, face it down instead. Besides, uh, XP points, uh, some of them could drop their health items. Yes, that's how I got like extra King's Rocks and Black Belts and Hard Stones. <laughs> Often just like fighting Pokemon. Sophie, you're gonna have to get out from under the desk. Go. Oh, I see. She like straight up just like unplugged the monitor. Oh, cool. It just straight up gave me dig. That's cool. Um, is dig even useful to me? It's kind of nice they order them by number, but at the same time, it's not because I want to see like my most recent one most of the time. I'm gonna decide if I'm gonna jump down there and like. Rhyme or dig. I'm gonna say no. I'm gonna cook a tasty rice with. Um, all those things have seeds. Epic Kuno seeds. Try my best to say like that that thing's name, but like it, I just want to call it Pepe so much. Only a few Pokemon can learn techniques passed on by my husband's family. You know, I read it. Ooh. So if I get an Eevee, I can come here and I can evolve into Scalion. 
which sounds very much like a dragon type evolution. I'm too old to venture in Eldwee's Mountain, it's time to pass the torch. Take it. Uh, is a compressed update for the next Porygon evolution? Let's see. Boldor. Okay, so Boldor is a standard one, so actually I could get one for Gengar eventually. Corporal's people um, used to worship an idol of fire believed to be an incarnation of the volcano itself. I wonder which Pokemon it was. Ooh, interesting. No one said it was a Pokemon until you. Mount Starburst. It's so majestic from down here. Ah, oh, man. I think Mom really needs a pet as a companion. I'll go on Route 13 and get her a cuddly Litten. That'd be fun. Kids these days are nothing but laid back. Back in my time, they'd have faced some real time on the volcano. That'd be cool. Um, Zaddy, Daddy, um, really is a sick rapper. I swear someday I'll go see him in Hyperion City. Yee yee is what I read, not yee yeah. Cardinal's Palace is on the other side of the bridge, but a soldier is guarding the entrance. Okay, uh, seems like a good time to stop right here. And let me plug back in my monitor. <sighs> That's why I don't like letting the animals under the desk. But they're all staring at me, so you know. Dragon type Pokemon are the most fearsome, but they blindly follow Cardinal's orders. Okay, interesting. The Queen had promptly informed me of your arrival. Anyway, I'm sorry to say that the Cardinal is on the top of Mount Starburst at the moment. Extraordinarily, wait, extraordinary, the Queen granted me the honor to give the permission to reach him, but on one condition. You must first defeat me in battle, and then, and only then, you will be allowed to reach the Cardinal. Do you read the terms? Eh, why not? I wonder if this guy's just like a fire type trainer, you know? Nope. Sure is not. Um. This is a rock type move, and I get hit pretty dang hard by it. But what am I really switching out to, to take it? Alright, here we go. Go Frost Breath. At least I can get the crit. Yep, there it is, there it is. I think I'm dead. Yeah. Yep. Like I said, I don't know who I was going to switch out to to take that. Even Fisher here, like, it would have been, uh, I would have resisted it. I didn't think it was going to be that resisted. Jeez. Well, that's unfortunate then. Uh, I guess I'm pulling back out my good old bird might probably. Either that or I can get the fighting bug out, but I think I would rather just take this straight ice type and not have another quad weakness mon. That's such a big thing in my mind, it's like quad weaknesses are just so hard to work with. Like, yes, I know I left him in on something that probably had a rock type move, but I don't know anyone who's just going to sit there and take that. I, I did, but like, I guess I didn't know that you can take it that stupidly well. Because I was worried about, you know, like, um, medieval, like, would a guy hit by a steel type move, Gyarados hit by a rock type move, Grammar's low level, uh, Pepe gets hit by both, um, rock and ground. So the only one who was 
really uh, something I could switch out to was Sandy Gast, but I didn't know if it was going to have a really strong ground type move too, so I'm just trying to explain my thought process as to why I went for what I did. So... Just give Gyarados my muscle band again. And Snow Day, you can take... Mm, Gyarados would be better with the King's Rock, so I'll probably just give it to him and give you the muscle band. Uh, but yeah, this is actually is going to be the end of the episode after I get everything um, put on Pokemon properly here. There we go. Yeah, this is going to go ahead and just be the end of the episode because it's much easier for me to do that. Um, and then we can use the next episode to target down um, the... We can climb my Mount Starburst. So, we'll see you guys then. Uh, bye.